Well, it's uh, one of them days again. Let's um, let's do a video. Today, I need my mouse, don't I? Oh dear. You get that off. My last video, I, I looked at KDE Plasma 6. I called it KDE 6. I'm going to keep calling it KDE 6 because it seems to annoy people. So I looked at that on KDE Neon's um, OS and that was quite nice. It, it just sort of flowed. I thought for completeness, I'd try and get it running on FreeBSD. So this is just a bog standard FreeBSD 14. Let's have a look and see if we can do it. Okay, so I've got some instructions. Whether there are any good instructions is a different matter, but we're going to give it a go and see how it goes. Now, my box is running um, Intel graphics, so there's a, an extra step that we're going to have to do that's not in these instructions. But th this instruction set is just installing Plasma 6, setting the StarX script, and uh, let's see how it goes, shall we? So... The one thing I will say about this is that, so this is running the, the latest packages, not quarterly. So if there's any issues with that, we'll have to face that as we go along. So let's get on with it. Oh, package install plasma six plasma. That's a great start, isn't it? <laughs> All right, let's see what it's called. <laughs> okay. 11 right okay let's change back to quarterly I wonder if that's why it's better try that again really what's going on here I wonder if it's needing the 604 what the smeg's going on what what's going on here hmm all right let's try that one kde6 Devil. No, it's just KD6 actually. Okay. What? 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 You're going to tell me it's still not there, aren't you? Well, I'm not doing this from ports because it'll be hours. This is ridiculous. There's no packages. All right. This is going to take a while to do this video, so I might have to come back another day once it's finished doing what I want it to do. That's really annoying. Where's all the packages? Yeah, that's that's really annoying. How has that disappeared? That's what I want to know. Why why is there no packages? Why is there no mention of it either? That's what I want to know. Yeah, this is what I want to own. Right. And that's five. I've done a lot of videos recently where things have just not worked. It's starting to get on my nerves. So, this may be a, a two-parter. Because it will take a while to build all these, these ports. Which is just annoying. As... Ugh. What a waste of time. Where are all the packages? I mean, people have had this running as long as three months ago. That's a frustration. Okay. We've got 
and the latest ports checked out so let's cd into x11 plasma 6 plasma is there i suspect this won't build properly now i'm going to leave it running and come back to it later so let's go into plasma 6 plasma i don't particularly like mixing ports and packages but there we go I install that as well. Yeah, it, it's just going to do this whole make config as well. I am not sitting here all day. Just not doing it. Okay. But that's the wrong way. Let's do it the right way. Let's get these options done. And then we'll let it do its build thing. This might take a while. Okay, so that's all the make configs done I'm going to let it do its thing I wonder how long it's going to take tune in next time this is the kind of thing that really frustrates users I have a little bit of experience with FreeBSD so I, I knew I could do it this way the packages were there, now they're not. They're not there on the quarterly branch and they're not there on the latest. That's pretty annoying. Like I said, tune in next time and we'll see what happens. Bye bye for now. So yesterday I was trying to get KDE Plasma 6 installed on my FreeBSD box. Didn't quite go to plan. There were no packages available from FreeBSD. Highly annoying. But that's the way it goes sometimes. Obviously, the port builders have not built them for whatever reason, whether it'll be a weird dependency thing or there's issues with something else I, I don't know I haven't got that information available what I started doing yesterday was building it from ports and then I thought to myself that's silly that's a silly way of doing it so I created a new jail on my Pudri box and started building it from that once that's finished I'll go ahead and get it installed but I just wanted to just tack this onto the end of yesterday's video it's not done as you can see here's my my build at the moment it's done 305 in about an hour and a half tell me how long it's been going for well it says there 248 packages per hour and it's done 305 it's roughly about an hour and a half oh there we go it started at 10 12 and it's now half 11 there we go a little bit over <laughs> once it's finished i'll install them that's the great thing about pudri and we've we've gone through it before like i said i set up a different jail there's my two jails i've got my amd 64 freebsd 14 that is the it's actually 14.1 stable i believe so that that's 14.1 and this is 14 yeah 14 release p6 so we'll we'll get those built we'll get them installed we'll get it set up and then we'll go from there and see what it's like i'm hoping it doesn't take too much longer i'm hoping that it'll be ready at some point today 
but I will do the filming of it on another day. So there you go. That, I'm halfway through apparently, but it's building LLVM 17. That'll take about nine hours probably. Um, yeah, come back next time. Subscribe. Um, you'll get a notification of when I actually do get this installed and uh, come along for the ride and see what it's like and, and see if it actually runs under Wayland or X11. I'm quite interested to find out how that's going to go. But for now, I'll uh, let it carry on and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.